What is going on, everybody? It is the Misfit Bear, and welcome back to Nier Automata. I know I haven't played this game in a while, but it's back. It's back in business. So don't worry. I know you missed it. I kind of did too. And the last time we left this game off, <coughs> excuse me, we uh fought a really gigantic robot. And now we have to uh find Yorha soldiers. Basically from the the remnants of the fight. I had to go and get this scanner or whatever from the um from the Shining Sisters. Got the scanner and now I'm getting constantly attacked by robots now. But hey, here's one at least. I guess I can't talk to you while I'm surrounded by robots. Hey, I am trying to breathe life back into my fellow comrade. Do you mind? I can fish from on top of a building. Can you imagine the length of the fishing line needed to do this? <clears throat> uh, it's not letting me talk to this one. I guess I might have already, I don't know. Aha, here we go. Really? Uh, okay. <clears throat> I will entertain you. Oh yeah, I found another uh pod. Ooh! So that's what the missiles do. That's what the missiles do. That is freaking awesome. But I need my scanner, though. It's too bad I can't, like, have them at the same time. That would have been great. No anomalies detected in black box signal. However, her language core seems to have been damaged. So I guess one of these is going to end up being 9S. At least I kind of understand what the scanner is doing now. <clears throat> the, the closer I am, the faster it beeps. Ow, gee. Ow! Woo! Woo! Uh, no? You can take you and that freaking buzzsaw motion on somewhere! I switched weapon things again by accident. Okay, you know what? This is how we're gonna do this, all right? <laughs> or I'm just not gonna waste my time. You know what, I'm not even gonna waste my time. I got homies to save, like that one. Well, I can't talk to this one, can I? Nope. All right, well, where are some other ones that I can find then? I guess I don't have a choice. I gotta be able to clear these freaking uh, machines out so I can successfully talk to them. But I guess I could sit here and just shoot for a bit. Just gonna stun on them for a bit. <laughs> and trust and believe the beginning of this gameplay is gonna be rather slow because I'm having to, you know, find all these different Yorha soldiers and there isn't going to be a lot of combat, so please bear with me for a bit.
Ah, there we go. Now you're only down to two, so... Oh, it's a robot in an actual little ship thing. That's what that is. There we go. All right, there we go. <clears throat> what about over here? I see that little dot on the map. Didn't I already look at this? But it's still closed, guys. Right not. Absolutely nothing of value here. I could have sworn that, <clears throat> hold on a second, is this the same, was that the same one that I saw like a few episodes back, or was that at a different location? Now I'm kind of curious now, yep, and there it will forever stand. Nah, I'm too far away from it now. Where is it? Oh, there you are. Okay, so I guess not all of them are going to have something to say. Okay. That one's not functioning. I can't go that way, because the minute I jump in the water, I'm dead. Let me pick that up. Can I talk to this one? No? Commencing fishing. Complete. My bad. <laughs> All right, so let's just, let's hit it now so we can get this finished. I'm getting distracted. Wait, what? Did that thing actually direct me to that item? Ah, okay, okay, I understand now. And a logic virus vaccine. Easy. I've contacted the bunker. They should be here soon. Thank you. We are currently searching for a missing your high unit, designation 9S. Should you possess any information on the subject, please disclose it at once. Please, anything will help. 9S, that's... That kid who was with you, right? Yeah, the homie! You saw him, all right. That explosion sent him flying. Which direction? Hard to say. I'll take my best guess at a landing spot and transfer the data to you. Thank you. You should stay here until the rescue team arrives. Target location data obtained. Marking on map. Woo! Thank you, your heart soldier! Now I get to go find my homie! Alright, so which direction do I go? Uh, sounds good. I'm like way over here. Okay, cool. I don't know why it said current location right there. That's, that's why I had to make sure I look. But you know, it's all good though. We're, we're, we're hot on the trail, so let's get it go. Let's get going, going, get gone. And not fall in the water. <laughs> uh, let's hustle now. 
But how's everybody doing today? Everybody good? Work good? You got your snacks and stuff? Right? I don't. Sadly, I don't. <laughs> <clears throat> Wait, is it just gonna pinpoint them like right over here? Because I like I don't I don't know. I'm all confused. Where exactly did he land at? Cause I'm not gonna lie and say the fight was hold on a second. Never mind. It's just right over here. I'm not going to worry about going and, you know, trying to get there faster. We're just going to sit there and we're just going to enjoy the run for a minute. We're going to enjoy the run. Because nothing says fun like running in the sewers. I was about to say, nothing says fun like running to the sewer through the sewers into a dead end. But I didn't look at the mini map. And then we're gonna also enjoy the music. The music is the best part of this. How do I get back up there, by the way? How does one get back up there? Is it even possible to get back up there? from down here? Huh, let's see. I mean, it should be. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, there we go, all right. And we're just gonna turn this corner here. I get the feeling he's on a roof somewhere. Really? I can't go in there? Wow. Okay. <laughs> then why did you leave that gap there, knowing you weren't going to let me go through there? That seems kind of pointless, game. Okay, so we're going to figure this out. The transmission seems to be coming from an underground cave network. So I'm a dumbass. What ended up happening was I went up. Yes, I went up. But I wasn't supposed to go up. My dumbass was like, wait, he's got to be on a freaking roof or something. Ow! It's like he's got to be on a daggum roof or something. No, he wasn't. He's supposed to be down here. Now, I don't know how he would have landed down here, which is why I didn't think about it. So I literally went in the entirely opposite direction than I should have. You gotta love how that crap happens, doesn't it? <laughs> Why are there dead androids here? No black box signals detected. Oh yeah, the fucking drill. Away from the last known position of Unit 9S. Wait, what? Better go back and see if there's another one. Do I have ow! Whoa! Okay. I guess I have to cut a path. Fuck it. I have no complaints. There must have been like another... Like another path... This way? Yeah, here we go. Made it this far inside? Alert. Possible enemy ambush ahead. Don't care. Really?
What? <laughs> oh. That was, um, that was my bad. Okay. Sorry about that. <laughs> this is bright. Whoa! What the hell? Copied city. That's, um, that's a little nuts. What is this? Analysis. This area is composed of crystallized silicon and carbon. Further details unknown. Who built it? Unknown. Clearly the aliens. Oh no, look at all the androids. Overclock? What the hell is Overclock? It is unlikely the Yorha units came this far on their own. Hypothesis. The enemy must have placed them here deliberately. Man, is that like just a regular machine? Or is that like a Yorha soldier, like decked out in some really sick armor? Yeah, that's got to be like some some seriously cool looking armor. Copied city. So did like the aliens like copy one of the cities from, you know, the surface? Or did they like or were these more Traitor, Yorha. Welcome to my beloved city. Oh boy. I, or we, machine life forms, I suppose, have a keen interest in humanity, love, family, religion. War. The more human records I unearth, the more charmed I am by their complexity. This city is one of many areas I create. I'm gonna hear him out. To understand, to know humans. It's grand, don't you think? Almost spiritual. His voice acting is amazing. Nothing more than an android graveyard. I seek to learn Adam. And adopt all facets of humanity. Okay, so this Some is Adam. Is love, others, family. I didn't realize Adam had glasses. That's what threw Only me off. Then did I realize the truth? I the thought uh, it was somebody else. Is conflict. They fight, steal, kill. This is humanity in its purest form. He ain't you know wrong. About He's not wrong to be. <laughs> Have I offended you, little android? Did I speak ill of your beloved humans? The truth can be so painful. I strive to attain nothing less than the essence of humanity itself. We machines exist in a connected world. Ooh, I love how you can dodge to the side invincible. and still attack. And yet, within all those infinite bits of data, there exists not even the merest flicker of being. Of life, death, even the concept of death, has no meaning to us. Whoa, where'd he go? <clears throat> Thus I decided that I shall risk my life in battle. He kind of looks like Bayonetta. He literally reminds me of Bayonetta. Like his face? I have severed my connection to the network. Now, let us embrace death.
Oh, so it's just an all-out brawl now. Whoa! The freaking angel kick you got going on? So this is a pretty basic fight to be quite honest. Nope. I say I'll be damned if you feel go kick me. I thought he disappeared. A Sorio can. <laughs> nope. I really should end up looking into upgrading my freaking weapons and stuff. Because I would feel that I should do more damage, but then again, I'm only level 17. I need to find 9S. Ah, 9S. Then again, I'm only level 17, and he's like 25. <laughs> yeah, you ain't laughing now, punk. Oh, I do enjoy this. I enjoy you too. He actually like, whoa, yeah, there was no way he landed here. Freaking Adam came in and took his ass. I prepared this just for you. I mean, after all, we all need something to fight for, don't we? You son of a, I'll kill you. Yes! That's it. That's the feeling. Pure hate! <laughs> so he's wanting to make me mad. Come to me! Round three, bitches! You know, I'm just going to dance around you, right? Oh, he moves faster. Come on, my boy. You got to put up a little bit more of a challenge. Okay, I spoke too soon. Wait a minute. Hold up. <laughs> he hit me with that combo, and I wasn't ready for it. Ow. Okay, that's what we're doing now. I ain't gonna lose to you. Fuck that. Nope. Yeah, I think sticking with the with the regular sword is ideal. Cuz I think yeah, the other sword is way too slow. You know what? I'm going to just keep it simple then. No, wait a minute. Okay, so I'd have to get that, you know, you know what? Hold on. While I'm being cocky, I'll have to, like, change it if I ever wanted to just have that weapon by itself, which would be ideal because maybe two-handing the weapon, just having it by itself would be stronger. I don't know. It would just have to be some experimenting I'd have to do later. But ultimately, there's no way I can lose this fight unless I just absolutely fuck up. 
Cause by the look of it, I'm gonna beat his ass. Yeah, that sword is way too slow. Doing that is one thing. Woo, that was slick. Woo. There we go. I just find so Jesus. funny that Death. as a machine, uh, you bleed. Uh, uh, oh. So dark. Oh. So Nobody messes with the homie. Come on, you know you want to call them nines. I guess their uh that swing had still registered from before the cutscene. Oh, homie. Oh, my brother. Speak to me. Come on. Let's go home. I'll be damned if y'all make me finish the rest of the game without 9S. Fuck that. You ain't taking the homie from me. Now the copied city is falling apart now, right? No? Okay. I thought it was falling apart. But hey, that was a... Uh, an okay fight? Damn. 9S really went through hell. You're the boss. You want him sent up to command body and all? I'll make it happen. Thanks. Yep. Oh, what? Nothing, just... You've never been much for gratitude, you know? She's right! mind or anything. Oh, um, I also have a message for you. Command needs you to contact them ASAP. Got it. Ooh, all right. This is 2B. Patch me through to the commander. Oh, hey, 2B. Roger that. Give me just a second here. Hey, 6-0. 2B, good job destroying that machine. Upon further analysis, we learned that the machine, codenamed Adam, was responsible for managing half of their entire network. The A rest is owned by Eve, right? Their network should weaken the machine significantly. What's going to happen to 9S? He'll undergo a full data overhaul up here. Assuming we don't encounter any problems, we're planning to partner him with you again. Yay! In the meantime, I have another mission for you. I've mailed you the briefing. Go ahead and take a look. Understood. To be out. Report. Mail notification received from access point. Well, I got a decent amount of money. I don't even know how you freaking use these. Don't want to burn through all of my freaking cash. I don't even think I even need these. So eventually I'm going to start doing like a big overhaul and just start getting rid of shit. Because I've got a lot of stuff. I especially have a lot of ore. But none of that ore is used to upgrade my weapons and stuff, is it? Like I need other shit. Let's see. Oh, I can actually upgrade the Virtuous Contract again. Sweetness. I still don't know about where Pyrite exists. Yeah, there was, there went a lot of my freaking money and I just said, that's as far as we can take it here. But there are craftsmen in the world who can raise it to level four. Oh, okay. Yeah, but like I said, there went all of my freaking money, and I just said I wasn't going to get rid of it. 
I still don't know what any of those chests are either. But whatever. We're gonna quick save. Then we're gonna check the inbox. Trends amongst the machines. <clears throat> Due to the destruction of Codename Adam, we have been able to seal a significant blow to the enemy's network system. I have already confirmed that numerous machine life forms have been severed from the network as a result. However, just because they are no longer connected doesn't mean they no longer pose a threat. It is highly likely that they will continue to interfere with our operations. 2B, I would like you to gather some intel on the machine life forms. Report back to me if you see any machines behaving oddly and keep me informed on their activities. That is all, the commander. Analyze current trends among the machines. Huh. Interesting. Something tells me this is going to involve a lot of killing. Proposal. Procure information from the machine life form known as Pascal. Yeah, I could definitely do that. I suppose he might know something. Pascal, can you hear me? Oh, hello, 2B. Do you need something? I need to know if you've seen any new trends or behaviors among the machines. New trends? Hmm, well... Two days ago, I was contacted by some machines that disconnected themselves from the network. They wanted to discuss a peace treaty. No kidding. Apparently, huh. they're seeking to form an alliance of some kind with our village. If that's what they want, why don't they move in? I believe they're working on building a colony of their own. Oh! Indeed. Apparently, it's located in the abandoned factory. I can give you the coordinates if you'd like. Please. Yes, I, I would enjoy to that. I speak with them myself, you know. Maybe we can meet up over there? Sounds good. Yeah, sounds damn Marking good. Location data obtained. Marking on map. Olive branch. Yeah, the uh the little uh peace treaty branch. Alright, let's see exactly where this is. Way over there. Where's the closest jump point to that? Uh, can I get, can I get there from the near factory city ruins one? I don't know. Let's find out. Here we go. Cause see, I was going to, uh, jump to Pascal's village because I didn't know 2B was going to freaking call him. <laughs> didn't know 2B was going to hit them digits. Remaining MP, 100%. What? Because when did I have magic points? At the abandoned factory. Hold on a second. Just, just, just l let me look at something real quick. Yeah, so no. Okay. Alright, so let me... Map mode. Let me hit that. And let's see if I can't... You know, somehow make my way over there. Am I able to get up here? That would make a lot of... Yes, I can! Yeah, that would make a lot of sense. Because this is literally like... Taking me over... The entirety of this place. And that does look like a factory. I'm gonna skip them for now. Yeah. All right, here we go. Now, while I'm over here, I need to be sure to find the uh the vending machine over here, get me a cola, and then, you know, I can mark my location there. Give me that. Aha! Give me my cola. You get 
right off of the cola. Save right quick. There we go. That has been unlocked. Give me that. Hold on a second. This is where I was in the beginning of the game, isn't it? Virtuous Treaty? Hold on a second. I'm really glad I came over there then. All weapons. Virtuous Contract, Beast Lord, Virtuous Treaty. Is that a large sword or a small sword? Oh, that's a large sword. Yo, see, I want to use that. I want to equip that. Just because. You know what? Fuck it. I have the katana combo. What? Um. Um. Okay, so I guess I really didn't need to end up buying any stuff. Was that one of my bodies? Oh, I'm so confused Are right now. The machines you seek to form an alliance with my village are hiding out here. Still, you should probably be careful. We machines can be rather unpredictable. Even you? In truth, yes. Now that we're cut off from the network, we no longer share data with each other. We can speak, of course, but I find that language contains many ways to hide one's true intentions. Actions speak louder than words. I can agree with that. Oh, look at the little look at the little butt cheek rocket booster. Yep, actions speak louder than words. Uh oh. You enter the domain of God. Okay. All right. So um. So we we had parental robots. Then we had festive robots. Now we have religious robots. I, I don't know how to feel about this one. I don't know how to feel about this one. But... You never judge a book by its cover. This all seems pretty shady if you ask me. So why are you still here? Well, I brought you this far, didn't I? It's my duty to see this through to the end. Aww. I love you too, Pascal. I say you were kind of jittering for a second. Are your circuits malfunctioning? Wow. This is going to be very interesting. This is going to be extreme. Oh my God. Pa Pascal, my, my God.
This is not His good. Grace has become a god. His His wondrous grace has become a god. His wondrous grace has become a god. We as well shall become as gods. We as well shall become as gods. All of you shall become as gods. All of you shall become as gods. All of you shall become as gods. All die together and become as gods. Oh dear. This is about to get real. I'm surrounded. I love it when I'm surrounded. No, less running, more fighting. Ah, uh, my current, yeah, of course. Damn it. Yeah, but what you gotta do, little homie, you have to give me a second, let me thin their numbers a bit, because I don't want to, you know, waste all of this precious material and this precious money and everything. So, can you wait a minute? Uh, Pascal, Pascal, bro, bro. You need to help me. You need to help me. I don't want to be sitting here doing all the fighting by myself. Granted, I mean, you know, this is going to be lovely XP for me. And I don't know if you need any, you know, what being an NPC and all that. But still, it would be awesome if you could help a sister out. Let me switch to the other one. Missile Barrage! <laughs> Woo! -hoo -hoo! Woo! Yeah. Die by the missiles! <laughs> Hold on. Hold that thought. <laughs> yeah, baby! Oh, so I am going to be taking everybody on. I'm going to be taking everybody out. Everybody is going to that big oil slick in the sky. Ow. And trust to believe I'm not going there before y'all. Woo! One second. Not done destroying yet. I mean, as an android, this is kind of my freaking job, you know? It is kind of my job to be able to destroy. Don't you know? So, I'm going to sit here and I'm going to destroy for a little bit more. Because it doesn't look like... Wait, are they just coming out of nowhere? Or or is this like an endless spawn area? Because if this is an endless spawn area, then you already know. You already know. Gamers will abuse this like nobody's business. There are so many of them. I'm going to destroy them all. <laughs> I'm going to destroy them all, if I can. By the look of it, there is absolutely no way for me to get rid of all of them. They just keep spawning. <laughs> and let me tell you, I cut through a great deal of them too. So I guess now was just my cue to get the hell out of Dodge. Whoa! You ain't riding on the elevator with me. You are not riding on the elevator with me. Um, elevator? There we go. Pascal, get in! 
<laughs> wow, man. What the fuck? Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's me. It's me. There is no way. Oh, I was about to say. Dang! You mean to tell me you hacked a robot from the freaking moon? You hacked a robot from the freaking moon. There's a shop in here? What the fuck? You know what? No. No. I, I I had I I had to I had to look at that. Ugh. Let us get the hell out of Dodge, baby. Man, I just love that view. Oh, boy. <gasps> just cut through. Anybody who is in your way, just cut through. What is with that camera angle, though? Ugh! Ugh, ow! Fuck off! Fuck off! Yeah, baby! Don't slow down for nothing! Except for this! Let me quick save right quick. <sighs> Wait, how do I get out of here? How how do how do I get out of here? Stop that, stop that, stop that. Fucking tablet. <laughs> how uh Pascal, do you have any words? No? Okay, well, I guess at this point, I will go ahead and I will leave this episode right here. I did a quick save and whatnot, so, uh, yeah. <laughs> Man, that got crazy for a second. Now we got religious robots, too? What else is gonna happen? Cthulhu? <laughs> I guess we'll find out. But I appreciate all of you for watching. Like and subscribe for more, for I will continue to make these videos for Mini Moons. Stay safe out there, and never forget to holla at your bear. Peace out.